Nathan, a tight affair, you just couldn't quite make the breakthrough. Yeah, I think I was just right to both sides, really. Plenty of endeavour, load of of honesty and, 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 and trying to make the breakthrough, but just lacked a bit of quality on the night. I mean, it's been said that they had better chances than us. I think they had one real good header first half that, that Smith should score. But apart from that, we've had a better chance. We've hit the bar, we've hit the post. We've had you know real good counter-attacks where they've been open and we've just had to make sure that we find the right one. Right at the end, we've had a wonderful counter-attack that, that, that we should have done better in. Pelly Ruddock's had a glorious chance because that's that's even though it's from 18 yards, it's an easy chance and, and we haven't quite showed enough quality. But look, it, uh, it showed, I'm so proud of the team because they've shown a real honesty that we, we didn't give up. We haven't played flippantly, we've played properly, we've kept the, the integrity of the league and our club and we're a credit to this league and we are a credit and guaranteed ourselves a top, a top half finish, which is some, some achievement. Sonny Bradley's header which went in, didn't look like much of a block on the goalkeeper, what was that for to me? You better ask him, don't, don't get me started on it because I thought there's a lot went on tonight that I wasn't happy with. Uh, it, there was fouls given that, that, that which just baffled me, absolutely baffled me. And certain things about it, I thought there was... I, I don't want to get myself in trouble, to be honest with you, but there's nothing wrong with that goal. It's just, to be honest with you, it's a safe one. Um, probably a safe decision right at, right at the end, so that neither side loses it. But I, I can't say his motivation. He said there was a foul on it, but it's, it's, a, it's, it's, it's a terrible decision. A fighting performance from your team. I mean, you, they, if they had come here thinking it was going to be easy for them, there was no way that was happening. They, they didn't, or they knew they wouldn't be. I mean, not, not a side has come in and uh, and thought it'd be an easy game. And anyone that did think it'd be an easy game have usually been uh, have gone home pointless. You know, in terms of that, I think teams now are seeing what we're doing, are respecting us. We have a respect of the championship. We're a top half side. Um, we wanted to establish ourselves and I think we've well and truly done that and I'm so proud of the group because, you know, w compared to other clubs we lack so much but compared to other clubs we have more than they have in abundance, in abundance and I'm so proud of that, of what we have and the group and what we've achieved because a top half finish is beneficial for everyone, it really is on, on every level and if we had said that one game to go we'd be on 62 points, we'd be guaranteed minimum 12. I think every sane Luton fan person that surrounds this football club would have taken that and I'm saying and I would have taken that. We were saying in commentary it must be a nightmare for other teams coming here with something riding on it massively and you come up against the Hatters because it's not going to be easy. No and, and look and that's, that's the integrity of the league I think. I think a majority of sides have that integrity you know. Um, we felt that we came up against a few sides last year that were flippant in, in certain things and we'll remember those but if I'm honest we, we just wanted to be us and we wanted to finish strongly, we wanted to get a result. You know. All right, no worries, pal. All right, top man. All the best on the weekend, yeah. And um, and we and we wanted to, to finish strongly. You know, it would have taken us up to 11th tonight, and that would have been every little place that we go up would have just been phenomenal. You know, and and but look, we're in a great place. We're we're delighted. We're six unbeaten. So many things, highest points total since 1982 in this division. So so many things to be proud of, and we're doing this on a shoestring compared to Sam and so proud of everyone at the club from top right through to, to, to the bottom. I suppose the only nightmare for you is that you've got to try and better this next season that's going to be really difficult. Well we've bettered every single season we've had you know and we've always planned to better so it's not wow where do we go now and we're shocked we you know we've been months we've had recruitment readings pretty much for the last two months now of trying to do it we're trying everything we can to keep our good players so that we move forward as, 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 as a group, move forward as a club. Um, and, uh, and, and then, look, if we manage to keep hold of the players we have, recruit as well, a bit more quality in, in what we do, then why shouldn't we be, be, be higher? I suppose these two home games, you picked up two points and it could have been more, couldn't it, against Middlesbrough and tonight's opponent? Well, look, definitely on the weekend because, you know, this, this was a marginal game and let's pay respect to Rotherham who, who came and fought and gave it their absolute everything when they're fighting for everything. But we've missed two pens against Middlesbrough and we should have, you know, an, an, another three points against Middlesbrough. So that was a real disappointing one because we'd been happy with four points from two games and yeah you want to win games but we're six unbeaten we've won our away games we've we've done well at home and and look it's a difficult one if we played Rotherham 
a month ago or, or whatever when it, when they had you know they were, they've had so many games and stuff they've actually come in, in a little bit of freshness into this one but so look it, it's it's it is what it is we we could ifs and buts and so on but look let's let's not take anything away 62 points 12th in the table guaranteed um, is a real real relative success story for us